This demo will show you how to use the front panel of an EPC 3000. The EPC 3004 in the demo has been configured with a quick code for a temperature control loop. The normal screen shows the measured temperature in green at the top of the screen and the set point in green below the measured value. The output percentage is shown as a horizontal bar graph at the bottom of the screen. The F1 button toggles between manual mode and auto mode for the PID loop. A hand symbol is shown when in manual mode. The scroll button goes through the main parameters. Pressing once shows the working output. The next press shows whether it is using the remote or local set point. After that, the first of two possible set points is shown, then the second set point, which may or may not be in use depending on the configuration that has been implemented, then the measured analog input in engineering units, then a second input, which may or may not be in use, and then back to the normal screen. Pressing the page button whilst scrolling will take you back to the normal screen. In auto mode, the set point can be altered using the up and down arrows. In manual mode, the output in percentage is shown instead of the set point and can be altered using the up and down arrows. And the output is also shown as a horizontal bar graph. If using the scroll, the value that you are showing can be changed with the up and down arrows, assuming that it is a writable parameter such as a set point. If a fault happens, such as an open circuit, the screen will show the alarm with an alarm bell here in the top right hand corner. The process value will be shown in red. Forced manual is selected, shown by the hand symbol. The PV will be in red if it's still in alarm or if it is not yet acknowledged. Use the wiring and installation sheet supplied with every EPC 3000 for further details regarding wiring, hardware options and quick codes.